This is the unboxing of a Cardiac Cardboard Computer from Bell Systems Educational developed by Bell Telephone Laboratories. The Bell Lab logo, an original Bell Labs logo right there. The envelope including stain which shows to me this is indeed not a replica but an original. And now the back of the envelope, no markings. And now the unboxing. We have one cardiac computer. Memory locations. The internals of the cardiac computer. These bugs are how you keep address spacing and memory locations. These sliders fit into the computer. This is the manual. Cardiac computers. A cardboard illustrative aid to computation. And this is a picture which shows computation. As you can see, this is the book that you would have had. Copyright date 1968. This is a third printing from 1970. And this appears to be the complete book as I remember it, including the goofy, goofy graphics. This man appears to be peeing on something. Oh no, he's heading toward the... What is he heading toward? The computer age! Oh my goodness! With our cardboard computer, we will go to the computer age. And this is just page, you know, one. This is page one of many pages. We're doing some... Oh, look at this. We're in school without computers, and we're learning about computers. The basic units of a simple computer. Yeah, it's really nice. Yeah, it's good. So basically, a cardiac computer is what this is. This is, once again, the book from, of course, once again, Bell Laboratories. And now, the instruction page on how to make the cardiac computer, the assembly instructions. See, you take that and you go that and you do that and then you put it together and it makes this. And then you take this over here and you put it over there and then you take slot A and you put it in slot B. You take that and you fold it up here to go back over here and then you go over there like that. Pretty easy, huh? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. And when the cardiac computer is built, as I remember it, this is the spot where the sliders will go in. This is your instruction space, your advance card. This is your stop. And this is your accumulator. This, right here. This is your accumulator. We call that memory today. This is your we'll scratch memory here. You can scratch the scratch memory. Scratch. And this is your input slot. And uh, all your other stuff goes here. Right. <clears throat> Again, these little holes will come out. One, oh, oh my horrors, one fell out. There's no longer a pristine set. <laughs> Too bad. And, uh, and this is very interesting. This is the actual opcodes. These are the instructions. Ink, Kla, Ad, Tak, Sofat, At, Ut, Saab. Jump, and there's a uh, there appears to be ten instructions, and then you you write your contents memory in here, then you move the little bugs around and you do that. But this is just the unboxing. This isn't this isn't actual working yet. This is just my hand talking to you about what this is.
Again, if you're confused, this is the cardiac computer, the cardboard, um, the cardboard illustrative aid to computation. Computation. Once again, the actual device, the instructions, and of course, the cool book. All of this was purchased from Edmund Scientific for 20 bucks, and it is worth every penny just to see once again, as I saw back in the 70s, that I was heading, that was me, except I was a lot heavier, I was heading to the computer age. Hey Ben, come here. You know where we're heading? Where are we heading? Where are we heading? You, you kind of look like that kid a little bit. His hair is not as cool as yours. So kind of stand like that. Can you stand like that? This is Ben, and he's heading to... Where are you heading? To that computer age. And what's going to get you there? The cardiac cardboard computer. And the next video will actually build it and show it working. Once again, this has been the unboxing of the cardiac computer with my hand and it all and my voice and a special guest appearance by Ben Higgins there you go very nice thank you for joining us on this great unboxing and if Gizmodo picks this up please get the name spelled right okay there you go thank you